How many clients, if you ask them, how are you feeling? They say, I'm feeling okay. And you know they're not. But they also, in a way, don't even know that they're not. So we always want to look for our clients' strengths, their cap how they got there. I mean, you know the, the stories, the histories that our clients have, that they got to where they are and are sitting next to us is in some ways a miracle. Because again, this, this whole thing is about how do we help people regulate? How do we help get them back at home in their bodies? There you go. Just feel your fingers, feel your hand. My hands feel shaky. Feel shaky? Yeah, let them shake. Just let them shake. Okay, as you feel that vibrate, that trembling, I'm gonna ask you just to say these words and just to notice what happens inside of you, sensations, thoughts, pictures, or memory, whatever. Just feeling the vibration, the shaking, the trembling. I want you to say, I'm alive. I'm alive. I'm alive and I'm here. I'm alive and I'm here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What happens? Kind of tightness. It tightens. The chest. Okay, so say it one more time again. I'm alive. I'm alive. I'm alive and I'm here. I'm alive and I'm here. I survived. I survived. Not everyone did. Not everyone did. And I'm here. And I'm here. And I'm alive. And I'm alive. Don't feel like shaking anymore. And the shaking's gone. So what I'm doing is I'm working with this so that he can again get a new, a different experience in his body of how to hold all of these feelings. The important thing is not to get at the emotions. It really isn't. It's to make this bigger container so that we can reflect on our emotions, we can observe them, we can learn from them.